Hey guys, Jason here with a word to the wise. A couple little things that I've been thinking about. During the last two years, we learned a lot that a lot of our medicine comes from China. Even though we've been dealing with all these other companies that are handing out doses, for some reason everybody was in a panic that the Chinese weren't making enough of our drugs for elderly and things like that. So if some sort of a situation happened with them where all of a sudden everybody was cut off, it could be like the, uh, the, the baby formula situation where people are scrambling trying to get basic goods, basic needs. Even though you got Canada and a lot of other people, they can say, well, we're running short. We don't have enough stock supply, etc." All natural uh, problems occur. Natural. Um, the other part is looking at the food shortage situation that is on everybody's lips. Building, building, building. Um, hearing farmers talking about, you know, fuel prices are, are tripled, fertilizer, yada, yada, yada. All you need is probably a little bit of water shortage and then you're going to have a real problem on your hands. So, looking at that, it makes me think the food shortage situation is going to be very key, very big part of the digital dollar. And what I mean by that is everybody's talking about this, but nobody's doing anything about it. Like they should just start, you know, doubling efforts. Um, where is the National Guard in all this? Where's all their numbers, you know, and all the, the, the scientists that work for the government coming out and saying, you know, we need to do something. If there's an asteroid coming for Earth, what do they do? Oh, they say that they build a, a big ship and they're gonna go and land on it and set off a nuke inside of it. And, you know, it's all those movies you've ever seen. They've always got some sort of plan to deal with some sort of catastrophe like that, but not a natural catastrophe. So it makes me wonder that, well, when all these things do happen and are happening, and then they say, well, you can't charge people these kind of prices for these kinds of things, yet you're in the digi dollar situation, well then think that, well, as long as you got all your, your paperwork signed and up to date and you're going with the flow that we say you need to be on to get all these things, well, then you can, uh, you know, you can, you can partake in the food, but you know, if you're not a part of the digi dollar, then well, then you're not, you're not doing enough to, to help others. And, and this is the systems we have in place. What's the problem? You said you're hungry. Here you go. I don't know how exactly they would do something like that, but looking at the way um, the bug situation seems to be going on, a lot of people are putting their headgear back on, and you know, there's there's other things that are other variables that are starting to rise, monkey business, and you know, others. I, I haven't watched the latest days of Noah, but I guarantee he's probably speaking about you know some sort of a new. I heard him talking about some sort of a new problem, you know, on the horizon. So, just a word to the wise. God bless.